Let me ask you, was it a purposeful decision? It seems like the two main characters that are the smartest and know the most are the kids. Yes. Was that a purposeful... Yes. Well, we wanted it to feel like... The, the reason for that is we didn't want it to straight up feel like a family comedy. We wanted it to always be like, wait, are they a family? Or are they a little mission? Uh, like, you know, are these kids? Or are they replicants? Like, who's smarter? Who's not? Like, we wanted it to look like a animation domination type Sunday night family show and then always subvert that and one of those things is that like the kids are kind of adults and then they're kind of kids and they're not even kids you know so making those choices right from the get go was, was a big part of it and, 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 oh, sorry. and starting from a sitcom-y place is always kind yeah. of anchors us so to your earlier question like we do start with a human place of what what would these stories feel like to us and then we just then we just go stupid with it yeah. <laughs> where, where was the decision to say and I want a big chunk of this to to directly reference Escape from New York. So, <laughs> so we were going to originally... Uh, I mean that in the best way. I don't no, know. no, no, no. Yeah. I mean, well, that was the original, in the very original pitch, we thought we were going to have to sneak it into the show because we were gunning to sell this to, to, a, to a linear big broadcast like Fox. Okay. And then it ended up going to Hulu. And once we knew it was going to Hulu, when we pitched it to Hulu, we were like, okay, here's some stuff that's changed. The first thing is, when you go onto Hulu... You can watch every episode of something if it's on there. Right. It's not like you had to catch it on broadcast. It's all there. And it changed the way Justin and I conceptualized how to do the wall story. We were going to do the wall story like itchy and scratchy at first. Where like you. every once in a while you were going to see a little bit. But once we knew it was going to be all on Hulu and we begged Hulu to let us binge drop. Because if you're right. just rolling through the episodes and the wall stuff is growing, you might not catch an episode week to week. And I never wanted that to happen. I got you. So like in the pitch to Hulu we were like the wall is going to take over episode 7 of the first season yeah. it's going to become this massive thing and it was like as writers we had never gotten to do that on like Rick and Morty you know it was something we had wanted to do but like we never could because it might be mystifying to somebody who didn't have the con like the context of it so yeah. it was always baked into it